What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Saying Stories coming at y'all with another video, man. As y'all can see by the title, man, look, my mama didn't play. You know what I'm saying? She ain't play when it, she ain't play when it came to, you know, us acting up. She definitely didn't play when it came to, like, school and stuff like that. She ain't play, act up. You gonna you gonna get that ass whooped. So, but and for the black people, y'all know how. Y'all know how our moms is. Like, y'all know how they are, man. So I, I only know I would be attempted to, like, being bad and stuff like that. I don't know why we constantly do it and we know what the consequences are going to be at the end of the day. Like, it's just hard-headed, man. I don't, like, but I know some Caucasian people that, um, that be, that be, whoop, that be whooping at us, too. And I know some that, you know, they kids talk to them any type of way and they just, like, you know, they just let it go. I'm like, um, you going to whoop his ass, the fuck, for saying this? But, um, before I get into the video, y'all, y'all don't already know what to do, man. Smack that, like, smack the like button, man. The thumbs up blue, man. We're gonna get straight into the video, man. So, I'm gonna tell y'all about this, this one time. I'm in, I'm in, like, eighth grade, man. You know, I'm on my way to high school, and I'm just, like, I'm just happy, you know. I'm acting up, you know. I'm I'm thinking I'm grown, so the teacher the day before she tell she going to tell um, she called my mom and tell her that I'm acting up in school and stuff like that. So you know my mom like if you keep acting up, you know what I'm saying it's gonna catch up with you. Me not thinking about it and not knowing what she's talking about, you know what I'm saying. I mean, I'm not really trying to hear nothing you trying to say, mom. You know what I'm saying. So the next day, um, she was my homeroom teacher, so she called. In the early morning, I'm acting up again. So she called my mom. <sighs> when she called my mom, my mom had came up there. She was up there by like 12 o'clock. My mom was like, all right. He don't want to listen. So she, look, I'm going to tell y'all, I'm I'm just being, acting up in class. You know what I mean? Acting up, I'm talking about being a clown, you know, being loud, yelling across the classroom and stuff. We probably doing our work and I'm up talking and stuff. So my mom... Bruh, she, like, she just walked through the door. She knocks on the door, and me, she knocked on the classroom door, and me, you know, not, um, not, you know, caring at the time, she knocked on the door, so, you know how it, the whole class look to see who, you know, who, who coming in the classroom and stuff like that. So, we all looking, and it's my mother. I'm like, oh, my God. But the thing was, I didn't just, like look and say, "Oh my God!" I, I was like, you know, ha <laughs> And then I look, and I'm like, "What the?" F I was like, "Oh shit!" So she sat in the back of the classroom. So everybody in the classroom, they knew it was somebody, mom, you know. And then she sat in the back. I had seen her. She seen me. You know, we had eye contact. She sat in the back of the classroom. I'm like. Oh my God! So I had to fix. I fixed up my act and stuff. You know, I was, you know, doing my work and stuff like that. But I had, I was already in trouble because she, she had already tricked on me and told her that I was acting up in school. So I'm like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? When I tell you I got the whooping of my life, bro. First off, she, she embarrassed me in front of the classroom. Why? Because the teacher asked a question in the classroom. She, my mom raised her hand. Then she was like, yes, Miss Cozy. That's my last name, Cozy. So she like, yes, Miss Cozy. Then she was like, my son know the answer. So they already knew who mom it was when she said Miss Cozy and stuff like that. Because that's what everybody called me. That's what everybody called me in class. So they already knew who mom it was. I'm like, oh, my God. So she like, uh, he know the answer. And I'm like. No, I don't. I ain't say no, I don't, but I'm looking around like, <sighs> like, no, I don't. So she was like, so what's the answer? I'm like, I don't know. But luckily, it went no females in my classroom because my classroom was an all boy. Like, they, we had them, they had us separated. All the, the girls had class by themselves and the boy had classes by themselves. We ain't had no, like, mixture classes. So a good thing went no females and I, I was just in there, like, with my, my homies and stuff like that. And I tell you, I got the whooping in my life, man. When she was like, in front of the whole class, bro. 
my mom, my teacher didn't care if what my mom did to me. She was like, if you don't tell her the right answer right now, I'm going to whoop your ass in this classroom. I'm like, I don't know the answer. Like, I'm like, I don't know the answer. How I know the, how I tell, you to tell her the answer if I don't know the answer? So she thought I was being smart with her when I said that. And then she was, she she like bucked her eyes and stuff there like that. And then she, next thing you know, she was fucking hitting on me in the classroom. And that was just like 50%. After she started beating on me and, you know, and stuff like that in the classroom, the kids, they just looking like, damn, and stuff. And, but they can't, they weren't laughing. They were just like looking like, damn, and stuff like, damn. You know, they was cursing like, damn, damn, and shit like that. And they still use, they still bother me. They still bug me about that to this day and stuff. How my mom came to the classroom and did that. But then when I got home, guess what happened? She made me bend over on the chair in the kitchen because she used to have this paddle, you know, this paddle that uh, is like a wooden two by four paddle. And she'll get in and she'll whip my ass with it. So she made me pull my clothes down until my ass cheeks out. She had the paddle. And she was whooping my ass. My butt cheeks was was red. I couldn't even sit down because my butt would burn and stuff like that. So it was like, oh my, oh my God, and stuff like that. So they let me go. They told us to go home early and stuff like that. And I came back the next day, a new person. But I didn't st like stop acting up though. I was just hard headed. I, I still didn't stop acting up, but. And some, from time to time, they'd be like, that's why your mama whooped your ass in the classroom and shit. And then I had to come, like, realize, like, when we was in high school, I'm like, don't act like y'all mama don't be whooping y'all ass and shit. We all, come on, we all black here. Don't act like your mama don't be whooping your ass. But they were like, the difference between us, we never got embarrassed. So I'm like, you know, you right about that. So when I got home, she whooped my ass some more, like, I'm talking about and if I got up out the chair while she was whooping me, it was going to be double. So I had to sit there and just take how many shots she was going to give me on my butt. So it was like burning and stuff like that. Then, so that was, I got in trouble. All because my teacher told on me. Like, why? Why you being a trick, man? Why you got to tell on me and shit, man? But that's what you get for acting a fool in class. So if you're an upcoming student, well, if you are a student, and you, a class clown, like I was, don't, don't do that, okay? Be a nice student in class. Because it's good for your teacher to like you. Because in high school, when I got in high school, I was like that, but I wasn't like I was in high school. I mean, eighth grade. But, um, more to the story, man, you know, be good in class, you know. Stay focused on class work and not being a drama type person, so... Yeah, that's the story, you guys, man. I got my ass whooped, man. The story of me getting my ass whooped in class in front of everybody. That's the story, you guys. But if you guys like the story, man, y'all already know what to do, man. Hit that like button, share, subscribe, comment. You know, my channel is, my channel, I think my channel is amazing. You know, you guys, um, I appreciate every single one of you, honestly. Um, without y'all, without, without subscribers, what would any YouTuber be? So think about that, you know? So I appreciate you guys. Hopefully all other YouTubers, you know, appreciate you, um, their subscribers as well, you know? So I thank you guys for, you know, tuning in to my story time. And, uh, it's your boy Insane, and I'm out, you guys. Peace.